The stones we carve are all Myanmar jadeite. Our products are Myanmar jadeite carvings. People do not usually use such good quality jadeite for carvings. Good material like this is usually used for bangles and pendants, but we use it for carvings. Our designer is now outlining the profile, following the stone shape to select a suitable theme. This is the first step of the carving process. These are all nationally famous jadeite artisans. Uh, they carve the stones based on their shapes and colors. For example, they can highlight good color by following the color distribution in this one. Basically, the carving's profile is determined by the stone shape. The stone designs and carvings are ingenious. For example, flowers were carved from the brownish area in this one, while this white one was made into a figure. Carvings are based on shape and color. So he's transcribing the picture by drawing directly onto the stone. They created several possible designs for this stone, and we will see which one is best. This jadeite is very colorful. Jadeite dealers usually make bangles with jadeite that look like this. Bangles made out of this material can be expensive. The material we use for carving are all very good quality. Other factories are reluctant to do this. The whole process includes designing, which we just saw, then carving, and the last step, polishing. The finished piece is accomplished by those steps in order. It cannot be completed with only a single process. Water must be used during carving or the material will get too dry. It is not yet finished. The artisan is now busy with fine carving and only the polishing step remains. This carving is quite large and worth millions. Artisans are highly paid. Monthly, they're paid more than a hundred thousand and annual salaries can reach more than a million yuan. That's a bit over 150,000 US dollars. Our artisan is carving the stone by following its shape and colors. The green area is being carved into a rugi. The carving follows the color variations. The purple area here is being carved into a peach. The overall design is determined by the stone's features. The carving has to be adjusted based on actual changes in appearance and conditions. There are not many artisans around the country, especially good ones. This is the case with Siwa. There are only a few highly skilled artisans in each factory. Others are only assistants. It will take two months to finish this carving. This one is almost done. We're now working on the country's largest jadeite carving. It's called King Ming Shanghe II, which means ascending the river on King Ming Festival. It is the largest jadeite carving in the country, even in Asia. It has not been made public on the mainland, but we like to show it to foreign friends because it is being carved from such huge and good quality material. <laughs>